Squad, ready up, let's get sweaty. With Mr. Shortino, helped by Mr. Fausto. Follow the gifts at your own pace as I share some fun facts about the history of video games and their characters. The first video games were developed by professors and scientists as research experiments in the 1950s. In 1967, Ralph Baer developed the first multiplayer video game system known as the Brown Box. The system could be used with a television and was sold as the Odyssey. The Odyssey never did very well and soon died out, but one of the games lived on as inspiration for Atari's game, Pong. This popular game started out in arcades before moving into homes. In 1977, Atari released the Atari 2600. This gaming device had multiple games and joysticks. In the late 1970s and early 1980s, Nintendo, a Japanese company, introduced Donkey Kong. Pac-Man was a popular arcade game. During the early 1980s, the video game industry crashed and several companies went bankrupt. In 1985, Nintendo released the Nintendo Entertainment System in the US. Better graphics and technology made the product a hit. They released Legend of Zelda and Super Mario Bros., games still popular today. In 1989, Nintendo released Game Boy, a handheld gaming device. Sega gained popularity during the 1990s, competing against Nintendo. In 1995, Sony released its first gaming console, PlayStation. PlayStation 2, released in 2000, is the best-selling game console of all time. And here are some definitions in case you didn't know. Protagonist, the lead or major character in a story. Antagonist, a character who actively opposes or works against another character in a story. Earthworm Jim Jim wasn't always a studly superworm. He was once just a spineless dirt eater with no real mission in his life. But then, unexpectedly, the evil Psycho was transporting a supersuit built by the genius Professor Monkey Forehead to clean pulsating, bloated, festering, sweaty, pus-filled, malformed slug for a butt. But along the way, it was stolen by a rebel. Although Psycho killed the rebel, the suit fell down to Earth, landing on an earthworm. That cosmic twist of fate placed Jim in control of an ultra-high-tech, indestructible, super space cyber suit. Anyway, Earthworm Jim found out that Princess What's-Her-Name had been captured and set out to save her. Meanwhile, there's a bounty on Jimmy and plenty of people are in line to take Queen Slug for a butt up on her offer. Now, Jim must make it to the princess and stay clear of Psycho, the intergalactic bounty hunter, until the final battle with Queen Slug for a butt. To accomplish this, you'll have to use every weapon and ability at your disposal to wriggle your way through dozens of original and just plain weird levels. Mario Mario, full name Mario Mario, previously known as Jumpman and developed under the nickname Mr. Video, is the main protagonist of the longest running video game series with the same name and the mascot for Nintendo. He is the love interest of Princess Peach and the older twin brother of Luigi. Mario is usually found jumping over Goombas, or punching walls, or kicking snapping turtles. Sometimes you may catch him flying or gliding. He is great at manipulating fire or ice. He can power up with super mushrooms and use fire flowers to fuel his fireball throws. From Zelda. Link is the main protagonist of the Legend of Zelda series. He is the everlasting hero of the setting, having appeared throughout the ages in a never-ending line of incarnations. The various heroes who use the name Link are courageous young boys or teenagers in green clothing who leave their homes to save the world from evil forces threatening it. Over the course of his adventure, Link defeats legions of evil monsters, explores vast lands, helps anyone he meets who is struggling, navigates deadly dungeons, and collects mythical items while pursuing his quest for justice and peace. In the end, he succeeds in his quest and becomes a legendary hero. His powers include swordsmanship, gliding, shape-shifting, and wind manipulation. P. 
Pikachu. Out of all the Nintendo characters, Pikachu is the cutest character of them all. He is always the best part in the Pokemon anime series, and there are very funny moments with him, such as his obsession of ketchup, for instance. Pikachu is an electric-type Pokemon. It's also the second evolution from a Pichu, but it would evolve later into a Raichu with a Thunderstone. Pikachu is also the mascot of the Pokemon franchise. The iconic Pokemon made his first appearance in the Pokemon Blue and Red games on February 27, 1996. Mega Man. Mega Man, known as Rockman in Japan, and known as Mega for short, is the main protagonist of the original Mega Man series, first debuting in the game of the same name in 1987. Mega Man's role in the original story is to battle the mad scientist, Dr. Wily, and his ever-growing army of robots, and stop them from taking over Earth by using their own special abilities against them. Utilizing his special Mega Buster arm cannon, and his ability to copy a defeated robot's special weapon, Mega Man must travel the world and endure harsh environments in order to bring Wily's menace to an end. With the help of his creator, Dr. Light and his assorted robotic companions, Mega Man's eventual goal is to one day achieve everlasting peace. Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong is Donkey Kong's sidekick and best friend. He first appears in Donkey Kong Country for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System as a young, boisterous monkey who had one main goal, to become a video game hero just like his friend, Donkey Kong. He accompanies Donkey Kong throughout Donkey Kong Island to battle King K. Rool and return the banana horde. Luigi. Luigi, or Luigi Mario, is the second in command for the Mario franchise and the protagonist of the Luigi's Mansion spin-off. Despite being player 2, Luigi has some things over Mario. Luigi is faster, can jump higher, is taller and is overall better looking than Mario in terms of design. Luigi is very supportive. He helps Mario rescue Peach. Although he is a coward, Luigi is not afraid to risk his life to save others. He saved Mario from King Boo and overcame his fear of ghosts. Samus. Samus Aran is the main protagonist of the Metroid series. She's an intergalactic bounty hunter who was adopted by the Chozo after her parents were killed by Ridley. There are many reasons why she rocks. Samus is Nintendo's very first female hero, as well as one of the first female protagonists in gaming. Her boxing ring title in Smash 4 and Ultimate says it all, Bounty Hunter Extraordinaire. Like every other hero, Samus is filled to the brim with courage, willpower, determination, and selflessness. She has defeated countless evil space monsters during her journeys. Samus was based on Ellen Ripley from the Alien series. One of my favorite movies, by the way.
Did you know? Released on Christmas in 1979, Atari's Adventure is considered the first action-adventure game. It also introduced the Easter Egg to the gaming world. Back then, Atari did not want to pay any royalties to the designers, give them any credit for their work, and treated them very poorly. Warren Robinette made sure he was given proper credit within the game without his boss's knowledge or consent in this now legendary move. Following a mysterious series of steps, players could move a dot down a corridor and the character, really just a colored square, would be able to enter a secret room in which the words created by Warren Robinette were displayed. This Easter egg ate up 5% of the cartridge's storage space, but instead of doling out the tens of thousands of dollars necessary to produce an Easter egg free version, Atari just left it in. Thus, the Easter egg was born. Sonic the Hedgehog Sonic the Hedgehog, mostly known simply by his preferred nickname, Sonic, is the video game company Sega's mascot and the main hero or protagonist of the quick, fun video game series he is named after. A blue anthropomorphic, or personified, hedgehog with plenty of attitude and personality, he lives up to his name by being able to run at supersonic speeds. Sonic has an arsenal, or stash of moves which include homing attack, light speed dash, boost, super peel out, and insta shield, among many others. His enemies better also watch out for his drop dash, slide, and fire somersault moves. Princess Peach Peach is the princess of the fictional Mushroom Kingdom, which is constantly under attack by Bowser. Princess Peach is classy, kind, clever, sociable, and adventurous. She has a warm heart and often acts unselfishly, putting her friends, loved ones, and citizens ahead of herself, and apologizes excessively for getting into trouble and requiring Mario to rescue her. While gentle by nature, Peach is also strong-willed and can hold her own in sports competitions and battle provided she is not already being held captive. But, while Peach is often considered the archetypal damsel in distress when it comes to video games, she is often shown to be actively working against her captors, such as sneaking around, searching for power-ups and or information to send to Mario in games such as Super Mario Galaxy and the Paper Mario series. Sub-Zero from Mortal Kombat Sub-Zero is a video game character from the Mortal Kombat series and one of the original characters in the first Mortal Kombat game in 1992. The backstory of the Sub-Zero character has been explored in various Mortal Kombat games and other media. The character made a return appearance in Mortal Kombat 2, in which it was revealed that the original Sub-Zero had died during the events of the first game and was replaced by his younger brother. In subsequent games, the younger brother remained as Sub-Zero while the elder brother became Noob Seba. The character has been described as descending from the Cryomancers, an ancient race of people possessing the ability to generate and control the powers of ice, which gives Sub-Zero the innate ability to control ice in many forms. Master Chief from Halo John was born in the county world of Eridanus II in the city of Elysium. From an early age, he was recognized as a physical ideal for a soldier. Before he was even seven years old, he was one of 74 other children to be kidnapped by the UNSC and turned into the ultimate killing machines via the Spartan II program. 
The children were taught history, military strategy, weapons, and received advanced physical training. It was here that John got a new name, John 117. He, alongside a small group of other children, were sent on training missions placed in the wilderness, such as Reach's Forest. He quickly showcased strategic thinking and was promoted to squad leader after impressing both his peers and the UNSC officials. Soon enough, John 117 received the rank of Master Chief Petty Officer, gaining at the same time his nickname, Master Chief. He was equipped with the Mark IV Molnir armor and a short time later paired up with the UNSC Cortana. Together they completed multiple training courses and missions, growing closer with each one. Spartan enhancements include enhanced bones with metal and enhanced muscles. His abilities include a thruster pack, which allows a quick dash in a given direction, a ground pound, which means that in midair, the Spartan can launch himself downward, striking the ground with a punch and dealing an area of effect damage. Spartans are expert climbers and sprinters, among other stellar abilities. Bowser Bowser, sometimes known as King Koopa, is a major character and the main antagonist of the Mario franchise. He is a large, powerful, fire-breathing Koopa who leads the Koopa Troop, an antagonistic organization of turtle-like creatures, and has been the arch-nemesis of Mario since his debut in Super Mario Bros. He has repeatedly kidnapped or attempted to kidnap Princess Peach with the ultimate goal of defeating Mario and taking over the Mushroom Kingdom. Bowser's defining traits are his monstrous appearance, full-throated roar, fire-breathing abilities, cruel personality, reptilian voice, and never-ending conflict with Mario and his unrequited crush for Peach. Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong is a brave yet carefree hero who highly cares for his friends and banana horde. However, he will become enraged when his bananas are stolen or threatened in any way, or when his friends are harmed. He is also sometimes depicted as somewhat dim-witted. He has a famous rivalry with Mario in the Mario vs. Donkey Kong series. Interestingly, his grandfather, Cranky Kong, was enemies with Mario, Jumpman, in the Donkey Kong arcade. Donkey Kong has tremendous strength and an unlimited supply of barrels. He has superb jumping, swinging, and climbing skills. Donkey Kong can easily produce destructive sound waves through claps and strong gusts of wind. He is an expert horn player and boxer, and is a proficient kart racer. Help Cubert solve puzzles while avoiding danger in this all new experience. Using intuitive swipe controls, jumping around ever changing levels has never been easier. Outwit Coily and a whole crew of colorful enemies by choosing your own path across dozens of patterns. Complete levels and tackle the classic arcade mode to unlock and play as Cubert's friends. How long can you jump? Features Dozens of puzzle based levels, classic and new arenas. Jump on cubes to change them to the target color. Unlock Cubert outfits and characters. Avoid coiling. Use rotating discs to lead enemies to their doom. Upgrade Cubert's abilities. Score higher to earn more coins. Climb the leaderboard in arcade mode. Marshmallow from Fortnite. Marshmallow is an icon series outfit in Fortnite, Battle Royale. He is part of the Marshmallow set. He's got a funky dance that can help you burn some extra calories. Get grooving.
Pac-Man is a fictional character known for his popular video games. He's a man who loves his family, has a bit of snark, and is willing to help those in need. He has a large appetite and the main enemy of the ghosts. Pack dots, also known as pellets or cookies, are easily the most common item in the Pac-Man games. In the arcade version, pack dots are the small, square, white dots, scattered about the stage. Power pellet, eating one of these gives him the ability to temporarily eat ghosts and spectral monsters. Rev roll, similar to Sonic Spin Dash, Pac-Man can charge a fast roll. It can also be used for moving platforms. Butt bounce, similar to Mario's ground pound, Pac-Man uses this to push large switches down as well as attack enemies. It also gives taller jump height. Among Us. Join your crewmates on a multiplayer game of teamwork and betrayal. Play online with 4 to 10 players as you attempt to hold your spaceship together and return back to civilization. But be aware, as there may be an alien imposter aboard. One crewmate has been replaced by a parasitic shapeshifter. Their goal is to eliminate the rest of the crew before the ship reaches home. The imposter will sabotage the ship, sneak through vents, deceive and frame others to remain anonymous and kill off the crew. While everyone is fixing up the ship, no one can talk to maintain anonymity. Once a body is reported, the surviving crew will openly debate who they think the imposter is. The imposter's goal is to pretend that they are a member of the crew. If the imposter is not voted off, everyone goes back to maintaining the ship until another body is found. If the imposter is voted off, the crew wins. Hopefully you enjoyed learning about the history of video games and some of its characters. If you enjoyed this video, please click like and then click subscribe on Shortino Super's YouTube channel for more fun videos to get you moving. Have a great day.